And to be fair, like 30% of this stuff, I was not supposed to be shopping for myself as Christmas shopping. Life goes up and it goes down. I know my mom's up. Hey pretties, welcome back to my channel. If you don't know me, my name is Tanya and I film all kinds of pink, girly, beauty, fashion, and lifestyle videos on this channel. If that's something you're into, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and push bell notifications so you don't miss any of my videos. For today, guys, I literally hunted down so many juicy couture items. I've been hunting these items down for months now, so um, all of this stuff was not purchased at one time. I did hunt down some of my favorite, most wanted juicy items from like TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Burlington, Home Goods. If you love Juicy Couture in pink and you've been with me since the Juicy Couture wipe days, do we remember that day? Do we remember it? <laughs> that was a crazy time. But if you remember that, you know they have Juicy Couture at Ross, Marshalls, TJ Maxx, Home Goods, and ever since that time, we all found out that Juicy Couture is back in those stores. And ever since then, we all love to find the cutest juicy items that they come out with in those stores. I mean, it's only normal because OG Juicy Couture is like non-existent at least not their daydreamers and stuff i know they have the website is back up and they have like different things on there which i will link their website down below if you're interested because some of the items that you can find at home goods and stuff is sometimes on there which is kind of crazy but yeah i'll link the website down below but yeah og juicy couture it's not back yet we don't know what's happening we don't know if it ever will be back and in the meantime we are going to find things that are accessible to us although i will admit not all of these items were easy to find although i like i would like to say that these are accessible and that you can just go to your burlington and find these the truth is there's a lot of ladies and girls that love juicy couture that love these things and so they sell out fairly quick yeah, and then we also have the girls who do buy them to sell on mercari and things like that so pretty much the juicy items do get wiped out easily um but every now and again you get lucky and you find some goodies so i'm going to show you guys everything i found give you guys a backstory of why i wanted it how i found it so that you can also find it and to make the video interesting obviously because it's not like and here's this and here's that but that's boring that's boring so i'm gonna give you guys stories <laughs> so let's go ahead and get started okay so this first item i wanted so bad i hunted for it four months for four months actually four months for four months and never found it finally i went on poshmark and i made an offer to someone and they sold me this at a decently fair price it was definitely still a little more than like retail price i'm sure yeah i was never able to find this in stores let me just show you the item i know you guys are like okay what is it like what is it stop talking <laughs> so it is this adorable fur juicy crossbody i just loved this specific one that came with the little um heart pom-pom because they did sell this by itself at some stores i also never found that one because either one i would have found i would have been happy with never actually found this bag period so this is so cute and they're so perfect for christmas gifts because it's like a little box and you already know i'm keeping these boxes to decorate my room like hello this is another reason why i really wanted the one that came at package like this because you can close it and it's the cutest little box you can even just like stack them and like store things in here like nail things or little knickknacks that maybe you have a hard time figuring out where to store like charger cords store just all kinds of stuff in these boxes so they're just amazing to have i've even turned some of these boxes into like makeup drawer organizers in the past like i use them to organize my makeup with and then like i will take the lid as like the other side and like it's two organizers so yeah there's just some ideas um i love that the little the, this one has like a little heart on the keychain so cute um should i open it i have not even taken this out this is what the inside looks like it just has the juicy couture modern day logo that's what i call it it's like the modern day lining i like that these are like a decently fair quality like these bags are not terrible quality you know what i mean i mean you kind of get what you pay for it's no original juicy couture obviously but they're good they're decent quality and then the back does have this which i love because this is so handy to be able to slide your phone in and out of this is a really cute winter date night bag i just love the fur it's it's gorgeous it's gorgeous and i'm gonna be honest i'm not always a fan 
of like the new juicy bags like the ross tj maxx juicy bags but when these furry ones came out yeah i had to have them so speaking of that i also ended up getting this one this one has stuff in it because i've been using it but this is like the viral TikTok juicy bag. I don't even remember who originally posted this. I don't even know if I saw the original poster of this, but I kept seeing it all over Instagram and TikTok. And it is a furry, speedy looking bag that comes with a crossbody strap, handles. It says Juicy Couture here. This is an adorable bag and it's very functional. I call this a Walmart bag when bags fit a lot, like when they pack a punch. I call them Walmart bags because like, you know you could fit all of Walmart in them. Um, there's currently stuff in there because I've been using this bag. I have like sunglasses. Uh, what else do I have? A dust bag. Receipts. Yeah, let's not turn this into a what's in my bag. This just has the same exact lining as the other purse. With the juicy couture all over it in black and white. A little pink tag. Um, what's next? Some adorable, adorable shoes. I ordered these from, I think, Macy's.com when they had them on sale for Black Friday. I'm like, you guys, I just, I can't deal. Like, I have an obsession with shoes and bags, and like, these shoes were just too cute. Like, can we not? Like, these are Bratz doll shoes. It's the best way I can describe them. These are legitimate Bratz doll shoes. They're so cute. I love the the style of them like how they're strappy they're kind of casual kind of sporty kind of dressy i don't know it says juicy here on the side yeah these are so cute so adorable i think i paid like no more than 20 dollars for these i love that they have the juicy plaque here on the side it just makes it feel like extra um i wear a size six in shoes FYI, and I ordered true to size. How Juicy Shoes come packaged is just satisfying to me. Like the pink tissue paper, like it's just, I love it. So I have a background story for these shoes. These shoes I actually really, really wanted for a while, but they didn't have in my size. I almost ordered them on Amazon for like double the price. I didn't know how much they're really worth because that's the place where I found them on Amazon. So I almost ordered them. They didn't have my size on Amazon. And then later on, I started browsing for juicy stuff online, and then I found them at Macy's for like half the price of the Amazon ones, plus the discount for Black Friday. So yeah, I ordered them. Now this one, I sadly ordered on Mercari because I couldn't find it. I couldn't find it anywhere. So I ordered it on Mercari. Paid too much for it, I'm gonna admit. I just... We're just not gonna think about it, okay? We're not gonna think about that. Being along um, with the furry theme, I also got this. This I did find myself at Ross, as you can see, for $16.99. And this is like the furry little like clutch, I don't know, pouch. It comes with a card holder and it says to from um, and it just, the box looks like this. So you could technically also keep this as like decor. You just like turn it around if you want. The inside of this one, it looks like this. It has like some card holder slots in there. I'm not gonna lie, this lining is does not feel the greatest, but it's fine. Like, it's not terrible, you know what I mean? It's fine. And it's really cute. I feel like this lining is really cute. Like, it looks really aesthetically cute. Um, I mainly got this so I can, like, put receipts or, like, makeup or something, and then it can go inside of the bigger purse, and then it's, like, all matching, and that kind of stuff just, like, makes my heart beat, so I love that. It does come with this little, like, chain, so you could hang it on your wrist if you wanted to, and yeah, this is her. I do have a card holder, however, I have so many juicy card holders that I don't know if I'm gonna actually keep this. If I end up selling it, I'll just post it on Poshmark or something. I will leave my Poshmark down below if you guys are interested. But I might keep it. I'm just gonna see, like, I'm gonna see. It feels really soft. It's like a really nice, soft. Is this faux leather? I think it's faux leather. Speaking of furry, juicy items that are inexpensive, I found these slippers for like $12. I'm not kidding, $12. Was it on Macy's? It was Macy's or JCPenney. It was one of those two, but I will link them down below if I can still find them. 
I'm gonna try to link as many of these items as I can find below like the ones that are available online and let me tell you guys I saw these a few times like around and I just finally caved when they were $12 I was like okay you just cannot beat that price and I don't know if you guys can tell but the juicy logo has like pearls on it it's gorgeous I'm obsessed I found this and it was on clearance for $4.99 so that was a steal and you guys know I'm a college student and I have like a college ID so I got this for my ID I even thought this would be nice to have like on a night out when you don't want to bring your purse it's like a little card holder and your ID shows so if you're gonna go to a bar or something and you need to show your ID you don't have to like take it out um, so I thought that was cool. I also really like how you can like unclasp the lanyard part and just have it like this and you could put it on your keychain or you could just like throw it in your purse or you could change the lanyard if you want and um, this is really cute. I love the little like dangly heart. Let me get closer. Yeah, it has like this cute little dangly heart that says Juicy Couture on it. I love how simple and elegant it looks to be honest. And it's really, really soft. And you guys, it has to be a very cute bag for me to like really love it and like use it from Juicy Couture Ross. Because I just, here's the truth, okay? I have a lot of bags. I do. I love bags. I collect them. It does have to be a very special bag for me to purchase it because I just have so many bags that I don't need any more bags. So it has to really kind of capture my eye. It's not that I don't think the other ones are cute because there's so many cute like Ross Juicy bags, but it just has to be one that really draws my attention. So we also picked up this one and I just loved, loved this colorway. Like this is very, very cute. I love the embossing on it, how it has like hearts and it says Juicy Couture in the different fonts. And I just thought this was very cute this is also very versatile because you can take out this pouch and you can wear it like this if you don't want the brown and then you can like use this pouch it's like it has a really strong zip tie so I'm not gonna yank it and break it but yeah this pouch like you can use it in your other bags as well so I just felt this was versatile this was really nice for when I want to do like a what's in my bag reel or something, you know, I can use this little pouch to put in like, I don't know, feminine products or something and put in another bag. But I also really like how it doubles the storage inside of this smaller bag, which I thought is really neat. We also have, I guess I have to unzip these together. We also have um, the inside of this one looks like this this inside is really neat because it has a zipper pouch as well and then it also has a slip pouch you could put your phone in or whatever this is just very um nice it's a very thoughtful useful looking bag i just feel like something like this is something i would reach for like for to quickly run to like the grocery store or whatever and just like something that's enough to throw my wallet phone and keys and it just it's adorable, to be honest. It's very, very cute. I was very happy when I found this. Speaking of this colorway, I found these wallets. Let me give you guys like a close-up of what the package looks like before you take it out. And I just love it has a little bow. This makes such a cute like, Christmas gift idea. Okay. So this one I found shortly after I found that bag and I was like, okay, we need the matching wallet for that bag. I'm a matching wallet kind of girl. I like to have matching wallets for my bags. have this wallet right here and the inside of it looks like this. It has a little zipper pouch, which is really neat for your change. It does have like a little spot here for another card or cards. It does come with the keychain thing if you want to turn this into a keychain or attach it to your bag or something we have another slip pocket and then we have some card slots this is a card holder which i love me a good card holder i'm a really big fan of card holders and this one's just really basic it does have the little the little heart it looks like this i realize i haven't been telling you guys where i found this stuff so the wallets i found these at marshall's and I think I told you guys I found this at Ross. This one I didn't tell you guys where I found and I don't even remember because it's not in here. The tag's not here. I think this was Burlington if I'm not mistaken. But yeah, 
Burlington had a lot of that brown and pink colorway. I was shocked when I found the wallets at Marshalls because I didn't know Marshalls. I didn't know that they all potentially carry the same colorways. Okay, speaking of that colorway, I found this wallet at Burlington. And this is just really pretty. It's that same pink and brown colorway. And I loved how the zipper part is pink here. And then the inside just looks like this. Just like a basic long wallet. I do carry around a checkbook now. And so I do appreciate longer wallets now. I usually like a longer wallet to keep my checkbook. Um, credit cards that I don't use all the time. I have a, a few credit cards now since I've been building my credit. I used to not have any credit cards. I know, wild. But... Yeah, I've been building my credit, so I have some credit cards now that I will keep in a wallet like this or like in, like things that I don't go for often. I will throw in something like this and then I will take a smaller wallet, like a card holder, and I will put my, my ID, like my driver's license and like my, you know, my cards that I use more often. Adorable makeup bag. Um, I found this one at Ross, and this comes with like a little travel, but like a little jar thing, like to put lotion or shampoo or something. Um, but I love the color of this. It's definitely a more like dusty, deeper pink, and I just love the velour fabric or like the velvet fabric. Some of these items I did get for a gift, so like this one is actually going to be a gift because I already own one of these. That's like. A different pink but this one's gonna be a gift I was low-key screaming when I found this because I found this before they launched the juicy couture and stony clover collection I unboxed so I was really excited because I always wanted a juicy cosmetic case but I'm just not willing to pay $300 for it on Depop or Mercari or whatever I'm just not like I understand they're rare and they're vintage and they're good quality but I'm not willing to pay more than a retail price for an item that's used I'm just not like it has to be very 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 rare very specific for me to pay that but I just wasn't willing to do it for a cosmetic case so when I found this cosmetic case I was so excited I found this at Burlington and then the Sony Clover and Juicy Couture collection came out and I got that one so yeah anyway this one has Juicy in like bedazzled letters in the front and then the zippers, you guys. Look at the zippers. They say Juicy Couture on them. I died. The inside is underwhelming because I really wish the inside lining was pink. But it's just black. And it's like this... I feel like letting you hear how it sounds is the best way to describe it. So next we have this. And oh my gosh, you guys. This was so unique. I was like... I've never seen that before. Like this shade of pink is so pretty i don't know what the shade of pink is oh i can tell you macaroon macaroon is the shade of this pink and i love it and i'm just noticing it's kind of bent a little bit anyway i found this one at ross for 10.99 and i do love pouches like this like i said i do tend to carry a checkbook and stuff like that and this is just handy to carry cash or a checkbook so or even just to put your feminine products in so yeah, the inside has like card slots, so you can use this as a wallet. It also has this slot here. Not sure what you could use that for, but it has it. The inside is just the, we're just going to call it the um, modern day Juicy Lightning. I got this because it matches a purse that I already own. And I love little compact wallets like this for every day. So this one has like the little coin area. And then you open it and it has a place for your ID. I like how this is see-through. I do like to have a see-through ID thing. And I don't know if you guys ever noticed, but the clear part of the ID, it has like a little heart cut out in the middle. Can you guys see it? I hope you can see it. I feel like these wallets feel really nice because how they have the juicy embossed into them. It just makes you think of something, you know, luxury. So I really like that. I figured I would show you guys the bag that matches that wallet. So you guys can see them together. Really cute. This wallet is really, really cute. So this is in the color macaroon as well. Oh, okay. So that's the same color as this. But I just want you guys to see like 
this has like a printing like a juicy couture printing this one has a juicy couture embossing in the heart so they're just like a little bit different but they are that same macaroon color apparently i really like this color so i also found a card holder in the macaroon color and it looks like this it just has juicy couture printing all over it i do already have a juicy couture card holder that's similar to this but it does not have any embossing it's just plain and it has the juicy couture across it um, this one just says juicy in this kind of a logo and it has the embossing and then it has a little heart keychain part so cute next at ross i found these adorable 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 makeup bags so this is so cute this is actually a gift for somebody so this, i'm not going to be keeping this lord knows i have uh, too many makeup bags for my own good but it's really adorable i really 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 like it and i like how i, mean, I can't open it because it's a gift you guys but it has like the big jc on it i like how it's like this pink iridescent croc print and then i like how the littler bag is like pink and gold just very very cute part of me really really wants to keep this but i just like i I, sh I really shouldn't i really shouldn't so next i did grab this travel case this i am keeping because i love these when i travel i travel quite a bit because of the wedding recently so um, i know i'm definitely going to be using this and i love how it has the hook so you can hang it in the bathroom wherever you're staying and then you don't have to like fill up the counter which is really nice and it just has a lot of nice compartments and i really liked the print on it Whew, it's a little hot next i have another pair of shoes and these are a pair of boots so i found these at marshall's and these are just adorable like they're the prettiest light pink i don't even have uggs this color which is what convinced me to buy these because my uggs are different shades of pink like they're a little darker than this this is a very very pale pink i did size up on these because i tend to like to wear my boots like this with fuzzy socks when it's really cold so i just sized up i also do wear thicker socks with boots like this so yes and because they're fluffy inside i size up because they tend to fit more snug than like normal boots so and can we not look at these look at the sparkles so I bought these. I was not supposed to be shopping for myself when I bought these. Um, can anyone relate? I was just Christmas shopping and I saw these. To be fair, I did buy these for someone else too, but <laughs> I just was like, okay, okay girl, you have to get those. Like, I could not leave them behind. I mean, to be fair, like 30% of this stuff. Was not supposed to be shopping for myself as christmas shopping <laughs> and to be fair some of these are gifts so i mean we're, ju we're just gonna say that to make me feel better okay don't judge me okay don't judge me you know you do it too start some jewelry pieces if i'm a lot closer that's because i really want to be able to show you guys so i picked up these from ross ross is usually where i find my juicy jewelry like my modern day juicy jewelry and these are really cute i love love the hearts and i love how dangly they are i feel like these will be really cute for christmas or new year's also finally finally found the earrings and the bracelet so i already own the necklace and i wear it all the time so when i found the matching earrings and bracelet i had to get them i found these at ross these were $9.99 and $6.99 for the little earrings. Really cute. I love the pearl detail. I'm telling you guys, in order for me to purchase, you know, the items from TJ Maxx and stuff, like the juicy items, they have to be very... They really have to catch my eye, to say the least, because I do own a lot of juicy already and... Let's be honest, it has to be something different for me. So, I also picked up a couple of items that were not from TJ Maxx, blah, 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 blah. How do I put it? Blah, 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 blah. What did I do? What am I saying? What am I saying? I also picked up a couple of items from Urban Outfitters online. I got a phone case. 
And I'm gonna be honest, I mean, this was only $10, but it's not the best phone case. Yeah, I don't really recommend the phone case because of the rhinestones falling off, but if you want it, it's just really cute. I mean, it's it's $10, it's up to you. Like, if, it's up to you, girl. I didn't know that the rhinestones would be falling off when I bought it or else I might have not bought it, but I also got this adorable journal. It seems like the rhinestones are a lot better on the journal. Like, they don't feel as flimsy on there. Um, but yeah, this is like a legit velour journal. The inside pages are blank. I was kind of hoping for, like, lined paper, but that's okay. Um, but this was really cute. They were really cheap on Black Friday, so hopefully they're still on sale. I will link them below. So I wanted to share with you guys my makeup bag that I got because um, I realized I don't think I've ever even shown you guys this. I might have shown you guys this in another video but yeah so this is the color difference just so you guys can see. So this one's for a gift and then this one is mine. The next few items I got for gifts so I'm just going to share with you guys what they look like. Um, just because they're all Juicy Couture and I figured you guys might enjoy seeing them. So I found this little purse at, I think this was Dee's Discounts. And it has like the cutest embossing in it. It has little hearts, stars, crowns. It says Juicy Couture in the OG like font as well as like the, the new modern font. I loved how the Juicy plaque is in the OG font. Like it's in the old school font really love it when I can find juicy items that represent the older like the older juicy couture you know this bag is also very interesting because it has like this divider in the middle which is really cute this is a really really cute bag also the color of pink this bag is I think is the macaroon color as well because it looks literally just like it so yeah pretty sure this is the macaroon color I also picked up this card holder or wallet in card holder wallet set this is hot pink this one's for a gift so picked up this one for a gift it's really cute print the brown with the flowers we also picked up this one i found this one at dd's discounts this one is deboss taffy the color and this is definitely a bit of a deeper pink, but it's still light pink. It's still in the light pink category. This one's just very pale pink, and this one's more of a, like, a darker light pink. I don't know if that's even making sense. But the back is plain. And then the inside doesn't have any card slots or anything. It's just plain. Alright guys, that is everything for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed and are having an awesome week. And happy holidays or Merry Christmas. To all of you, I'm trying to upload a video every single day this week. Uh, guys, pray for me because it's intense when you upload every day, but I really want to do it because I have a lot of videos that I want to show you guys before Christmas, so I have one week to do that. So we're going to try to do that. So, alright guys, I'm going to let you guys go so I can get to editing this video and get it up for you guys. I love you and I will see y'all in the next one. Mwah. Bye. Life goes up and it goes down. I know my mom taught me that I figured why we fool around